Hey guys, Pandemic here for Leverage Cinema, and welcome to episode 2 of my add-on configuration series. Episode 2 is on Pitbull unit frames. And uh, just to warn you guys, this is quite long. So, strap in and let's get started. So, this is what Pitbull looks like at default settings. Um, I'm going to have you target yourself and drag two or three actually off. Put the second one right here and put the other two up here. Now either click on the minimap button or type slash pit to bring up the Pitbull unit frames um, standalone interface. And uh, first of all we are going to go to groups and disable. Next we are going to go to units and turn off targets target and focuses targets target. Wow that's a mouthful. Um, those are unnecessary units and you probably wouldn't need them anyway. So um, enough of that let's go into our layout editor and turn the width up to 245 and the height to 90. Press enter and um, why don't we go to modules and check that portrait is enabled and it is so let's go to um, indicators portrait enable um, let's do side center and position as bar, make sure that is checked. And turn the height to eight. <clears throat> All right, now let's go to bars and turn off experience bar, threat bar, rep bar, and alternate power bar and if blank space is enabled which it shouldn't be on default just make sure that it's disabled and let's change our default texture to banto bar it's personal preference and let's go to health bar and change the height to four and position make sure that's at one and power bar height at four and make sure the position is three and next we're going to go to text and make sure our default font is um, frizz quadrata tt and now we are going to change our current text to name and move the location to outside left and what that does is it moves the, the name to the outside left. And the reason I do that is because I don't like it crowding where the, um, the health bar is. So now that that's there, we'll change the size to 115. And now let's go to class change the text to scrolling combat text enigma and the location to outside left and the size to 110 and for that for that font you need to make sure you have um, scrolling combat text and also um, scrolling combat text damage I'll put the links of the of every um, add-on needed for this in the description. Um, all right, let's change the current text to health and move it to middle, and change current text to power and move it to middle as well. Um, now we're going to go
go to let's see oh wait never mind we're gonna make a new layout called target press ok now um, just to make sure I have which one's correct okay that's good this one is your targets target and this one is your target um, now let's go to texts in the layout editor and change class to outside right hmm let's see here that didn't really work out very well units let's go to target now layout editor and outside right why isn't that working okay there we go okay so let's go to our layout editor again go to text and class should be outside right um, let's go to name outside right as well and then hold on a second here let's go to targets target in the units and scale it down to 70 and leave that right over here let's drag these down bring that up here gonna drag these down so they're more visible near his feet and then gonna change um, the unit to focus and change the scale to the exact same thing and let's focus myself so you guys can see there's focus and there's focus target let's change the layout to target and set the scale also to 70 let's set these up here And once again, this is all personal preference. This is how I how I like my add-ons. So um, I'm not sure what the next add-on I'm going to cover will be, but send me your request and let's get this one down. So uh, this has been Pandemic 4 Leverage Cinema. See you later, guys.